So for me, School Street's a window into what the school run could look like if we all, all chose to drive um, less, walk, cycle, scoot to schools. Um, by restricting traffic outside the, the school gates, we can create a safe space where people can come together, uh, where children can play, where parents can have a natter with each other, get to know each other, where schools can build better relationships with residents and, and with parents and children. Um, and ultimately, we, we're in, trying to encourage more people to walk, cycle and scoot to school. So eliminating all that stress that we normally see with the school run in terms of cars and poor parent parking and replacing it with something far more positive. One of the biggest challenges we have is making sure that people have the opportunity to be active as part of their family life. It's you know, a very, very busy time for everybody, the start of a new school year. You know, some people are starting new jobs, lockdown has eased and we're kind of trying to get back to normal life. So finding time to be fit and healthy and active can be a challenge. But one of the best ways to be active is to just include it in your normal day-to-day -day life and use your short journeys to walk or cycle if you can. So today we're at a school where we have um, multiple families arriving at school, some with uh, several siblings in the same school, and they're all being able to walk or cycle, scoot to school because we have um, a closed road behind us. And we'd like to see more of these school streets appearing across the region, across the country, to enable people to leave their cars behind and have a, a healthy walk in the morning. The concern I think all parents have is, is that you're, you're bringing children to a road that has three schools on it, next door to each other, and the sheer volume of traffic, not bad traffic, not good traffic, just the volume of it at pick up and drop off can be, you know, can, it can be dangerous. It's fantastic, it's fun, um, great, yeah, it's getting children um, to understand what they need to do to look after our planet. It surprised me that if there was no cars, we'd just stand in the middle of the road and nothing would come. It was a lot nicer environment. It's spot on for kids especially. Because they don't get, they've got to be careful walking down here normally because obviously all traffic, all cars. So to open the street up just to let them go on the road and play in the road, you can see on the faces they're loving it. It can get a bit, you know, a bit rough with people being in there. Well done, love. well done. It can be a bit uh, tricky getting across the roads and yeah, it's a bit tight on pavements as well because the parking on pavements is hard for me to, to get past. This morning is giving me a chance to talk to the parents, to interact, to get to know them more because um, I don't get that chance. I don't get the chance to do that. I just drop off, stay off the hill and I go back. It's good because it, it's basically saying that people need, uh, people need to walk rather than drive because driving creates fumes which, um, destroy, which is destroying the environment. Um, um, it's quite it's fun because, quite fun because um, we get to ride his bikes. And yeah. This morning we had all the like, this and guy with frizzy hair came in and, um, and we get to do like all these workshop events, so it's quite fun. We're a very active school, so we always want our children to be cycling, scooting or walking to school and being active during the school day. Um, obviously the environment is a big issue at the moment, so we're always talking about the environment to the children. So, And our street is probably the busiest in Barnsley, if not Yorkshire, during the school day. So the benefit from today, hopefully we'll see, people might have seen that there's places to park a little bit further away and just do that last bit as a walk, which hopefully will, will last longer. Um, and if it could turn into a more permanent solution, then I think the benefits would just be massive.